Well, what happens when you eat gluten? It can't be that bad. It's that bad. Have you ever had food poisoning? While being kicked in the gut and punched in the head? That's pretty much what it feels like. I mean, we suffer a lot. We have abdominal cramps, muscle cramps, diarrhea. Well, bless your heart, sweetheart. Can't you just take like an allergy pill or use an EpiPen? Well, no, it's not an allergy. It's an autoimmune disease. Bloating, fatigue, brain fog. Oh, my sweet schnookums, you're gonna grow out of it. Wouldn't that be nice? But we can't, we will never grow out of it. It is a lifelong condition. So you can eat it if it's like vegan or organic. Vegan? We can eat meat. It really doesn't matter if it's organic or not. Iron deficiencies, vitamin deficiencies, joint pain. Well, you're not going to make you a sale. No. Can you just take the bread off? I could. But there's still remnants and crumbs of the bread on there, so I could still get sick just as if I'd eaten the bread. Why are you such a picky eater? Nausea, gas, depression. Well, my cousin's neighbors, sisters, brothers, uncle twice removed took this supplement and they used to have celiac disease, but they don't know more. I'll keep the disease. Here you go, I made you a muffin. There's no nuts in it, you can eat it. Thank you, but nuts have nothing to do with gluten. Irritability, anxiety, migraines, well, I just don't get any of this. Can you eat rice? Potatoes? <coughs> well, since gluten is in wheat, rye, and barley, but sometimes oats. Yeah, I can eat potatoes, rice, and corn. I've eaten gluten-free food and it tastes terrible. Thanks. Um, do you even know what foods are gluten-free? Yeah, maybe back in the day it used to taste terrible, but not anymore. We have lots of great options. Oh, just nonsense. It's all in your head. The blood test, the biopsy, doctors and the scientists would disagree with that. Rashes, vomiting, weight loss. Oh my God. I would literally die if I couldn't eat bread and pasta. First of all, I don't think you understand the definition of literally, but second of all, you would die if you had celiac disease and you kept eating bread and pasta. Hey guys, look, we know you're not trying to be rude. We know that you're just trying to support us, but being supportive means doing a little research and having a little understanding. Do we have a sense of humor? Absolutely. We just want the jokes to be on our terms. So listen, if you have somebody in your life that has celiac disease, do a little research, have a little understanding, take care of them, and take care of yourselves.